Have you ever told somebody I'm sorry and the person didn't take you serious? Or have you ever told somebody I'm sorry but you didn't really mean to apologize? Well, today let's deal with that. How to apologize. My name is Corey Sobe. Welcome to my channel. And if you're new to this channel, you're still to subscribe, please consider smashing that subscribe button and turning on your notification bell so that whenever I upload videos like this, you get notified. I'm sorry is not an apology. I'm sorry is a non-apology apology. You can call it non-pology. It's a polite way of expressing sympathy. When you say I'm sorry, it doesn't necessarily mean that you're at fault. You're just expressing sympathy. So that is why at times you tell people that you're sorry and they don't take you serious. You're sorry, they begin to ask a lot of questions. What are you sorry for? Why are you sorry? What do you want to do about it? What are you really asking for? Are you apologizing or what? So they get to ask a lot of questions. Why? Because I'm sorry is general. It's a general statement. It's not specific. I'm sorry doesn't fully express the feelings of the heart and people are aware of this that is why at times you say that i'm sorry and you still do what you were sorry for i'm sorry is different from i apologize i'm sorry is different from i'm at fault please forgive me they are different so today i will be sharing with you five steps on how to seek for forgiveness number one express regret let the person understand that actually you came to understanding that what you did was wrong. Let the person understand that you regret those actions. Number two, accept responsibility. Accepting responsibility is a sign of maturity. It tells the person who is hurt that actually you know what is right and you have understanding of what you are supposed to do. Number three, restitution. It's not all about being forgiven. If you hurt someone and you regret your actions and you accept responsibility, it's important you restitute. If you actually hurt someone like you wounded somebody and you are asking for forgiveness, it's wise for you to get some drugs. That is restitution. If you didn't show up for the date, restitution means you set another date. Number four, express your desire to change. The reason why people do not forgive you is because they think you are taking them for granted. Whenever you seek for forgiveness, they know that you are still going to do it again. I'm not asking you to give promises. I'm asking you to express your desire to change. Let them understand that actually you are truly not happy with what happened and you won't like to repeat it again. And number five, request forgiveness. Say, please forgive me. Say, I apologize. Remember what I said, I'm sorry is not an apology. 